Hey guys, um, energy is vibing right now on the planet. It is extremely, extremely high. Our sun is reacting to what we are doing at this present moment. Um, we have to understand that everything is shifting, right? And these beings are watching the sun closely. They don't know what to do. Only thing they know what to do is make it cold, make it cold, make it cold. All right. You have to understand we're dealing with beings who, um, whose bodies are not um, able to operate with the planet. All right. No matter how much they um, try to placate that, oh you know, yeah, this, this, this. When the extreme temperatures arise, they show their true form. As the original beings, we have sat back too long. We have really sat back too long. And we're watching ourselves now come into the risen state. All right. We're watching ourselves come into the risen state. And it's, it's beautiful. It's, it's, a, it's a powerful awakening state. Um, just to know that we can open the gateways within us. And the gateways that we open within us are also open in the planet. All right. Understand the power that is within us. We who are the original beings are the atoms of this world. We are the atomic structures of the planet. When you open the gateways within yourself, you open the gateways into the planet. When you tap into that, you know, we talk about that chi energy, that chi power within yourself, you tap into the sun. And the sun is going to react to what you do. All right? And you say, oh, the sun is doing things that, the, that we didn't expect it to do. Watch this. Watch Stereo A get blown out. Watch the energy from the sun blow away. Stereo A is already put in place. They're going to be in the dark then because they're not going to want to know what to do. All right? Understand that we were designed for this planet. We were designed through this universe. And everything that we do, the universe reacts to us. The galaxy reacts to us. The planet reacts to us. Everything reacts to us as the original beings. So it is important that you understand that we set the precedent for all of this. Without us, things would not be in play. All right. When we were fast asleep, you didn't have all this activity from the sun. Mm -mm. When we were fast asleep, you didn't have this activity from the sun. You didn't have active solar storms that were like every fucking hour. We didn't have this. So now, what we have now is our sun reacting. All right. Next, we're going to start talking about how to activate the lunar energy in us. We're going to go deep into the lunar energy. All right. And so that you all can understand how we also can control the energy coming from the moon. What we're doing now, you tapping into your solar plexus, brothers and sisters. You doing your chi energy, your chi exercises. You are literally causing our sun to react to us. And these inorganic beings, they, some of them will admit this and others will not because they're still trying to understand the science of the planet. But we must understand the science of the planet is behind the original beings. All right. 
Understand, understand, understand who we are as original beings. All right? The science of our planet is uh, 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 in reaction to the science of us. All right? Just like Elon Musk and all those satellites up there. Somebody, one of us, I don't know who it was, saw that and linked it to the sun. And it may be more than likely somebody who doesn't watch this channel. Because I was like, somebody linked it to the sun and sent direct energy um, shots directly to the sun. From the sun to those um, satellites. And pretty much destroyed all of them. All right. So, what we do is a complete um, link into the celestial bodies around us. All right. Each part of us is linked into a, um, a planet. Each part of us is linked into the sun. Each part of us is linked to the moon. All right. And understand, we are celestial beings. When we say that we are celestial beings, angelic beings, that means we have control over this entire universe. This is our universe. In our highest spirit form, some freaking unknown lifetimes ago, what we said, 968 nine million calendar years. All right. Some time ago, we created this universe. Past lifetimes. Why do you think the whole ordeal on um, the parent control system is upon us? The whole birth control system is upon us. They don't want us to give birth because when we give birth, we give birth to those who came before us. And they're wise and they're intelligent. But so many of us are caught up in this system. All right. And the vision of this system is to, to control the planet. Our visions are supposed to be to be in tune with nature. Our vision is more powerful than their vision. Being in tune means that you are one with the complete natural order of our universe, our galaxy, our star system, our planet, nature alone. All right? When you're in unity, it doesn't mean that you're in control. That means that you control everything around you. All right? So our galactic sun, our black sun is responding all right, the black sun is responding to us in our awakened state. Our moon is responding to us in our awakened state. Our planet is responding to us. And this is part of you understanding your level of consciousness or your level of awakening. That awakened state, bringing forth the energies that have been dormant for time beyond time. Centuries after understanding why you must activate these energies, you're understanding why you must um, be part of this force, be part of this sector of life. It is us who has the power to control everything around us. Alright, it's us who has the power. No one else on the planet can do that. Like we brothers and sisters, what we talk about, we can link it to that chi. We have that ability to link it to your chi. And what's your chi do? Your chi gives you that ability to link it to anything and everything. Chi opens up big ways that you can link into their system and shut down their entire system. With that, what's your chi That's why we talk about building and creating because why would that's all a part of the chain. That's all a part of the chain. Links into the sun. The chain links into the moon as well. All right. So, so put it 
understand that. We have control of this. Jesus, oh God, no Allah, no Holy Spirit, the whole Yahweh, the whole Yahweh, the whole you know, all these whoever's, they're not controlling anything, brothers and sisters. Those people were asleep. Our son was not active. Those who were asleep, our son was not active. Now we are fully awakened. The activity of our son is reacting to us because our son is supposed to always be active in that sense. Which means that we have to work to take on that. Alright? The, 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 the whole in this whole ordeal, we must con um we must battle against our enemies with weapons much higher than what they have. They can only battle us with things that can kill and hurt. We fight back with things that can bring balance and completely destroy that which is out of balance. And like we said before, this is why they never, you know, came to us and said, oh, you can do this, the gay do this, you know, if you look, you know, there's a whole, there are people who are doing this high chi and, and meditation and there's our people in the church and religion talking about, oh, meditation is evil and and yoga is evil and, and, and praising yourself is evil. You got to praise God. What God? You are God. So our awakening is causing things to happen around us but now we have to go deep within ourselves to take control of our planet you don't take control of your planet by trying to physically fight your enemies you take control of your planet by linking it to yourself understand the technology that they use and they're using the internal networking system which means just like we said in Lucy where you have the ability to link into yourself and link into their entire system shut it down it takes a lot of seriousness it takes a lot of approach it takes a lot of discipline but in all efforts the whole point is you being in balance your balance doesn't constitute winning or losing your balance constitute what? balance when you balance that means you are equal to the energy of the cosmos equal to the energy of nature equal to the energy of the universe equal to the energy of the gal galaxy equal to the energy of the star system equal to the energy of our planet equal to the energy of the forces all around us that's what balance is all about being equal being one with one band one sound you know <laughs> you know that's that's what it's all about one band, one sound, one energy, one frequency, one vibration. All right, there's no brother or sister who's more powerful than the other. When you all linked into the source, no one is more powerful than the other. But each one has their their own measure of power, which each one has a different ability. All right, and your ability is upon this is 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 uh destined upon your character, your personality who you are this is where your ability comes in this is where your power comes in this is where your energy comes in everything all of this plays a definite role in everything that we do right now so because you have linked into yourself you're watching our planet shift also because you said I want change I want this thing to be done I want this thing over Everything is reacting around you, brothers and sisters, because you are what? The owners of this planet. You are nature. And all of the millions and millions of us who are here, I, I really, really wish that they could link into this. I'm not getting no money for this. I'm not, um, um, don't have no, um, what you call it, what's that, um, Monetize, I'm not getting monet. I'm not have don't have a monetization on this um, YouTube channel. I'm not getting paid for this. All that I want to see is the brothers and sisters fully awakened. 
so that we can link into this energy that belongs to us. All right. So it is you who are changing everything. It is you who are changing everything. And because you have made that decision, brothers and sisters, you are now rising to who you are supposed to be. All right. Understand and understand, understand what our enemies are doing. All right. Understand what, we, what they're doing. Understand how they're fighting against us. Understand how they're fighting against themselves, trying to fight against us. They don't know what to do. The rise of the ancient ones. And we are rising into a new energy, rising into a new power. You feel this chi energy as you build every day. And this, and I want to talk about chi energy every day so that you all can remember to build upon your chi. Build upon this energy. Build upon this power. What do we say? We say when we, when I had the things that we created in the old days, we didn't have to create something else. What we built upon what we created and we made it even more powerful. So what did you do? You build it upon yourself and making yourself more powerful, making yourself more energetic, making yourself more wise, more knowledgeable. All right. Making yourself more prudent. Remember, prudent means blameless or flawless. All right. So understand understand overstand that you are the source of everything that is happening here on the planet that is happening in the universe you can link into the sun brothers and sisters and you can send energy to yourself from the sun and when that energy comes to you it comes to the planet all right henceforth coronal mass ejections some brother or sister who's linked into some crazy energy and power going to the state of meditation. And when you see, they say, oh yeah, this hit here, or this hit there, that's a brother or sister or a group of brothers and sisters who are in this powerful conscious state pulling energy from the sun and it's coming directly to the planet. And that's the key in this. Understanding, understanding, overstanding who we are, pulling energy from the moon. Like we said, we're gonna we're gonna go into the the, the how to link into the moon. You know, your soul links into the sun, but your heart links into the moon. <laughs> you feel me? We're gonna go into that, but it's important to understand, understand, understand where we are right now, my brothers and sisters. So as we continue to build upon ourselves, as we continue to create different things and structures, we open up gateways of power and energy that rest upon our bosom. And this energy takes us into other gateways. Therefore, you can learn, relearn how to build portals and and dimensional gateways and stargates. I mean, there's so much that we did in our past that's been long forgotten in this current state. So we can literally reshape our future. Remember, we talked about that one time before. Is that what you do now in the present allows you to reshape the future. All right. You see the future instead of going to the future and trying to destroy your enemies in the future. You what? reshape the present and when you reshape the present day you have already made way for a new future you've already made way for a new energy a new you know a new everything so you have to fight your enemies on a higher level which is a spiritual level and it's a heavy battle believe me brothers because they are they are trying hard their technology, artificial intelligence versus natural intelligence. And we're the naturally intelligent beings. And they're fighting very hard to keep us or to push us into a sleep state because they want to push us back into a sleep state. And this, this is the time we don't go back into the state. This is the time we come into the even more heavier awakened state. 
you know, like we said before, we got to stay this way. We can't get lax anymore because every time we got lax, we had an enemy that came into our planet. All right. So the key in this one um, is to power ourselves up. We're going to soon do a mass meditation, a mass, a chi mass meditation. All right. We're going to very soon, we're going to do a chi mass meditation. Um, let you guys know when we do this. Um, I think it's going to be this week, and we're going to do a chi mass meditation where we will link directly into our chi. <sighs> we'll do this together as one body to bring forth the energy from our sun as well as our moon, all right, to end this that we're dealing with here. With us awakening, we literally can end the system tomorrow in our awakened energy. And you must understand the magnitude in that statement into the system tomorrow because the system is fragile, it's weak, it, it has no foundation. They've got to keep doing the same thing over and over and over and over and over again to try to um, keep themselves protected. They tell you the energy from the sun is is a, is a threat to their technology and to their lives. They tell you this. So what do you do? You link it to the sun, link it to the moon. All right. As the angels of this world, right? those who are angels are those who are fully awakened to who they are, and there's lots of us who are fully awakened. Because some of us are not on this, uh, not in tune to this channel, but others of us are in tune to it. So it will behoove us to continue practicing, doing everything that we do, because this is a continual thing. This energy is continual. This power is continual. Everything is continual. It never stops. It keeps going. It keeps going. It never stops. And and we stopped. Why? Because we failed. And we fell into a deep sleep under a spell that he's being put upon us. But now the spell doesn't work anymore. The spell is gone. Which means that we've got to literally show ourselves who we really are. Like we said, just like Lucy, they showed us. We're the ones who can link it to the internet. We're the ones who can link it to the TV stations. Make announcements. How do they do that? We are force we are nature nature is a force the cosmos is a force the universe is a force as well as celestial bodies as well as celestial organisms we are that the atomic structure of it all and to fight against something so powerful is literally futile but understand who we are where we stand who what, what we are all about and our whole portion here on the planet is to what? Build the planet. All right. Create that utopian society where we will uh, recreate our planet to be a, a universal power station. That's what that's what we will create our planet to be the first time. A universal power station. Other brothers and sisters all over this universe, and this universe is vast and infinite, can come here and get whatever resource they want to get, charge up, charge themselves up. They can, you know come here and rest here for a while, go back home, you know, that's, this is what we wanted this planet to be, but we have an enemy here who's reproduced itself over and over and over again, and then end up tricking the original beings after they tried to kill them off. It's important. All right, it's highly important. So, because you link it to the sun the science behind this because you link it to yourself you link it to the sun because you link it to the sun you link it to yourself when you sun gazing you gazing into yourself that energy that's within the sun is that same energy within you you building yourself within yourself when you're moon gazing you're, 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 you're gazing within yourself that lunar energy alright it, it all works together Mars, Mercury, Jupiter, Venus, Neptune, Uranus, Saturn, Pluto, all these, right? All these planets are within us. 
very, very, very powerful planets. Extremely powerful planets. And all of the, the, the radioactive period, uh, uh, elements on the periodic table are within us. For the kingdom of God is within you. What is the kingdom of God? The cosmos. The cosmos, the universe, is within you. Which means that we were created directly from this energy, and this energy is within us. Right? This energy is within us, and it's a powerful energy. So it would behoove us to want to go deeper into this energy so that we can um remain and go into a more powerful state of being that's who we are the original beings you want it to stop being cold link it to yourself find the energy let the energy come from the sun and the moon let the energy come from the ground understand that you control everything brothers and sisters this is you under your control i know a few times i've Made it warm right here in, 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 in the Michigan area. I've done it many times. And then these inorganic beings found out the, the encrypted codes. And what did they do? They they went and uh, recalibrated their system and say, okay, we're going to do this right here. So it's a constant fight. They're constantly trying to protect their equipment, their technology, the, the shit that they created for that monetary system. They're constantly trying to create that. And we're like, no, it's gonna be this way. And this is why our planet is shifting. The magnetic fields are, are are literally doing the limit away every day. Magnetic fields are just dropping away. And that's that plasma energy. When you, when you like we said, when you have a certain amount of plasma uh, uh, protons, and plasma electrons, because this is what how elect, um, magnetism is created. You have plasma protons, plasma electrons, equal amount of them coming together in a certain area. That magnetic field, they, they create a magnetic field. But these atoms are separating. All right, these atoms are separating, which means that um, they separate and the positive plasma or the positive the pi, the positive plasma plasma um, atoms all right are transform transferring over to negative plasma atoms so you're talking about um, a, a negative balanced energy all right negative is a feminine energy so you have all these plasma protons transferring over to electrons and this is what's happening so all the all the all, this is why the magnetic fields are going away because these these protons are becoming electrons in order to create like i say i'm, I'm saying it again in order to create magnetism you must have the equal amount of protons and electrons protons are the positive energy electrons are the negative energy but what's happening these protons are converting over to electrons which means that this entire energy on the planet will be what a negative energy planet negative which is a feminine energy which is going to be a plasma based planet which means that everything will have to shift this is why why you think they want to try to create electric cars they know about this all right they know about this they want to create electric cars but the problem is is that their money won't work anymore. That's why they're saying, well, you've got to invest in cryptocurrency. Why? Well, if cryptocurrency is for the future, we don't need currency at all because this is our planet. Don't fall into that trap and get happy because you're virtually rich. It's only for, you know, the virtual, which is not actual. In actuality, you're already rich because of all the elements and and and, and um, um, everything that's within you, the elements that's within you, you know, the the the, the knowledge of the ancestor, ancestral knowledge is that's one that's what makes you rich. The knowledge of who you are, knowledge of self, that's what makes you rich. When you talk about rich, you're talking about wealth. When you got a wealth of knowledge, which means that you can link into anything, things that money cannot buy. Not whatsoever. 
All right. So I just shared it with you all. Hope you understand. You are the source of it all. You are the source of everything. All right. Stay tuned um, soon for that um, mass chief meditation that we're going to have because we're all going to do this together. All right. I'll make the time and make the date and we're all going to do this together. And it's going to be a powerful thing, brothers and sisters. And I'll make sure I don't say nothing crazy that's going to get me um, booted off Facebook. I mean, off YouTube, like what happened, you know, some weeks ago when we were supposed to be doing that at home. <laughs> all right, guys, I'll catch you later. You know the deal. All power to the multi chakra celestial and jelly beans. May chaos ring with you forever and ever and ever. Remember, chaos brings change, not peace. All right, much power to you all.